you want to have more than 4 hours of battery life on your S8, S8 Plus or Note 8, then this video is perfect for you. Hey guys, this is Second Gen 1. Today I'm going to show you how to extend your Samsung Galaxy S8, S8 Plus and Note 8 battery life without the need of disabling Bluetooth or Wi-Fi all the time. You can enable them and set your resolution to the highest and you will still get 4 to 5 hours or more screen on time. Anyways, go to the settings. The first step is to click on Wi-Fi and then from here click on Wi-Fi again then advance. And make sure that you check Wi-Fi power saving mode. This won't affect your internet speed but it will limit the usage of analyzing the patterns of your Wi-Fi. So that will help to save up your battery life and it won't affect your internet speed. You can check it out. Now make sure that you uncheck this option if it's enabled. Then this one, if you don't use NFC, then I do recommend you to switch it off. Otherwise, there's a quick option here in which you can toggle off the option. Now once that is done, make sure that you use location only when you need it. Otherwise, switch it off. Now here, make sure that you uncheck this option because this drains a lot of your battery life and then go back. Now Samsung Cloud, this is the culprit of your battery life drainage. So all you have to do is, is to make sure that you press on backup settings and then it should take two to five minutes for it to load. If it's loaded, then make sure that you uncheck auto backup. Now once that is done, just go back then back. Now from here on what you have to do is, is to click on display. Then I just want to let you guys know that I usually put my brightness to the highest but for the sake of this video I'm putting it on the medium. Just make sure that you uncheck auto brightness because that lowers your battery life and use blue light filter at night time. Screen mode, not necessary to change anything here. Then screen resolution, you can keep on 1440p or 1080p, there's not much of a difference, but you can test it out. Then LED indicator, you can just keep that on if it's switched off. And make sure that you check this option in which it turns off your screen when it's not used. Now here, video enhancer, make sure that you uncheck this option because it doesn't really make your video experience that vivid. So I do recommend you to switch it off. Otherwise, just switch on when needed. Now go to always on display. If you guys don't rely on always on display for time, then I do recommend you to switch it off. Anyways, once that is done, just go back, then wallpapers and themes. Now if you pick any themes, make sure that you pick any wallpapers that is mostly in black color. That means if there is a wallpaper black color, then those pixels turns off which saves a lot of battery life. Now once you have picked any of your wallpaper, make sure that you uncheck motion effect because that will save more of your battery life. Now going back to settings, click on advanced features, then uncheck say if you are not using that, then you can uncheck direct call if you are not using that as well. You have easy mute, uncheck that because that keeps your sensors on all the time, then uncheck these two options. Now device maintenance, this is the most important step here, so I do recommend you to follow it up. So from here on, what you have to do is, is to click on battery icon, then press on the top right corner, advanced settings, then make sure that you uncheck fast charging mode, because what it does is, it does in fact fast up the charging, however, it reduces the battery capacity, which may affect the lifespan of your Samsung Galaxy S8, S8 Plus, or Note 8 battery life. So right now, I do have Samsung Galaxy S6, S7 Edge, and I still use it with five to four hours off screen on time. So do keep that in mind. You can use it only when it is an emergency. Otherwise, do uncheck it and make sure that you uncheck app power monitor because it will monitor your background apps continuously, which may drain battery life. Now, once that is done, make sure that you keep it off. However, if you do notice that your battery is drained a lot, then you can check mid power saving mode and that should save you another one or two hours of battery life. Just click on general management and make sure that you uncheck report diagnostic information then click on marketing information and uncheck receive market information. 
And yeah, guys, that's basically it. If you like, like, subscribe if you haven't so already, and let me know what kind of videos you want to see next, and peace out.